Hey, what is up everyone? It has been a while since I've last gotten on the survival world, but um, or since I have last recorded, but I have quite a couple things that I have actually built with my girl girlfriend for the past few weeks that I haven't been recording or things like that. I'm sorry for the lack of videos for anyone who is watching. I just have not been motivated enough to go ahead and keep uploading. Um, I got caught with school at the time. Uh, I've been going full time at work, but that is not going to stop me now. Now that I have more, more, or, more or, or less settled into my life, so uh, let's get started with this. So the first thing that I that that I have to show you guys is that I have built uh, quite a couple things within the world. Um, I believe that we last left at the village, which is actually in that direction. But we're not we're not gonna go over there because not much has changed other, other than the chest being empty um, all the time because we have actually moved down here into this better location which is a lot more it's actually clear there's more opportunity to go ahead and expand so with that being said let's get down to the house so um, where I last left off playing Minecraft whenever my my girl and I decided to go ahead and play for a bit. Um, I last left off with actually hold up I'm gonna get the land up land up that way I can uh, have her join me all right so now that she's uh, that the land local game is on she can join anyways so she's actually been mining a lot and I I did uh, for the roof of this uh, building it's gonna I think I believe it's like what two two floors two floors I think I think I'm not too sure guys actually it's just a uh, uh, nope, nope. It's going to be a three-floor building on, on this side of the, uh, this side of the build, uh, of the house. <laughs> Sorry, I've been stuttering. I'm not as good as I used to, or actually, I was never as good as I used to be, at, be at commentating. But I've actually gotten a little bit better. Uh, this top tower right here is going to be a little bit, uh, just one floor higher, even though it's going to be connected with the roof right here. Anyways, I decided to go ahead and use granite, uh, for the roof. Just because we had uh, quite a bit of it uh, in the chests at the time, because I actually ran out and I need to mi either you know I need her to go ahead and keep mining and collecting this type of block, or I could just go mining myself and try to try to boost up the process of collecting this type of block. But at the moment, I'm I am in no hurry. I'm just kind of going going ahead and building. Um, I am in no hurry because I actually have to go ahead and build. Uh, keep building the rest of the building. I mean, I'm not going to finish the roof, but I can actually finish some of the other, other things that are within the building. So, this will be the nice little base that we will be cozying up in. That we will cozy up in while we go ahead and build up uh, the rest of our uh, civilization here. So, let's get to it. I actually forgot to mention how good these farms look. Um, I ended up uh, creating a wheat farm. Uh, well, I don't need to just use it for just wheat, but I did create a wheat farm here, and I actually fenced it all the way in. Um, in, in the corners, I put a log and a slab, a cobblestone slab, and I kind of did the same type of style here, style here, but with the uh, with cow pen. I do I do plan on expanding this uh, in the near future, um, which actually I may end up doing that in this episode because I actually need some uh some sheep uh, i know there's a horse over there i don't need horses just just yet but uh, i do need to go ahead and collect those sheep so let's go let's go get some supplies prepared for that uh i'm gonna do the house at another at another time off camera because i don't need to go ahead and do and show all the building that i'm gonna do i'm not the best builder by any means but i just don't want, like feel interested to go ahead and uh record the process for this so all those other chests are actually pretty well organized by my girl. By my girl, so what I'm gonna do is just plop everything right here, which I honestly kind of forgot what I actually decided to put. It, what I actually had all these materials for. Whoops. And yeah, I'm just gonna leave them all here because, like I said, I don't know why I had them in there, in my inventory in the first place. Um, okay, so. Okay, so we're gonna have to get some oak log. Okay, we got the oak logs. Uh, actually, we don't need that much. Uh, oh, 
fence will fence will greatly be appreciated. Let's see if we can get some cobblestone in there. Yep, look at look, look at all that cobblestone from all the mining she's done. She's done, she has done an amazing job just collecting and collecting. Let's go ahead and make ourselves a few slabs. All right, this is where the magic begins. We go ahead and create a bunch of oak planks. We go ahead and create a bunch of sticks, and we just go ham on the on the fences. All right, this is a good amount. Of, this is a good amount, but I don't. I feel like we need gates now. Eight gates. I think this should be fine. Why do I want this? What you ask? Well, I kind of just want this for uh, not just the sheep, but I also I also want to put more animals in there. I want to add chicken, uh, just a, just a few chicken, not a lot, because I do plan on making an automatic chicken farm for that. So, all right. So on this part, um, oh, I just messed up. All right. So what I plan to do here is making it three blocks wide. Uh, including this block right here, so. Just like so. And then going ahead and aligning this corner right here with this other one. And actually, we'll put the slabs right here. Actually, let me just go ahead and turn this uh, auto jump off. I'm not one of those players that actually likes auto jump, so that is why I took it off. I'm not fond of it because I've actually started playing Minecraft without that stuff so um, yeah took it off all right so we're gonna go ahead and kind of expand this way so apparently she wants me to go ahead and tell you guys that she found like 26 diamonds in her mining trips um, I have really haven't found much uh, ever since the beginning over there in, a, in our little uh, mine shaft over there at our original home but ever since we moved here, she's been mining, like I said. You guys saw the cobblestone, and she's actually collected 26 diamonds. So she actually got pretty good at the game. Super cute. Uh, just because I uh, just because I actually thought that I, I recorded a certain part I wanted to say that she actually collected 26 diamonds which is backed up by the evidence of all the cobblestone you guys saw the ridiculous amount of cobblestone uh, just, w just wanted to go ahead and point that out there before I actually forgot because I just noticed that I was uh, uh, pausing the record you know clicking the pause button at the wrong moments <laughs> all right just minding my own business I'm gonna go get my shovel all right, so now, uh, now I've actually finished the little landscaping slash creating pens for sheep and and another type of animal I should probably add. I should probably actually now that I'm thinking about it, I should actually turn this into a little horse barn uh, with the hor the actual horse facility right here and this small little pen leading out to it. Sounds like a great idea. Um. But for sure this will be the sheep, and for sure this will be cow. Uh, I'm a little concerned because it's it's a, it's a little too close to the house, and I don't want it to be super loud. But it's far away that I believe it shouldn't be so loud. So I'll just leave it at that. There's one single cow. I should probably get a... I remember seeing a sheep somewhere, but I need to get another cow to pair this one in. And just as I zoomed in, I see a sheep staring at me. Anyways, so I got a few. <laughs> yes. So, anyways, I got a few supplies here. I got, as you guys can see, I got four water buckets. I got, I got some polished diorite. I got some fence uh, again. And I am actually getting ready to go ahead and create my chicken farm. Um, little chicken egg farm. And I want to connect the, I want to connect the the egg collection system. I want to connect that to some automatic redstone shooter with the eggs to go ahead and create uh, chickens, uh, baby chickens, which will in turn grow, uh, grow up. And I want you know, I want lava to be above the baby chickens so that they're they're when their babies are tiny enough not to die, but when they grow up, they grow grow up and burn. Or actually, oh, never mind. I I just thought of some great ideas, but. That is what I want to do for sure right now is create a chicken farm. So 
what I need to do. Huh? Alright, so this is what I have so far, guys. I have actually gone ahead and created a frame, uh, a, a square frame. I don't know the specifications. I kind of just went, uh, well, I kind of went 10 by 10 on the block. Uh, or the square uh, for the for, for this building. I planked it up uh, underneath except these four in the center. I went ahead and had four water buckets to go ahead and water each uh, each one of the four corners within this cube and went and also made sure to go ahead and put signs there that way water does not pass underneath. So my plan here is to go ahead and, well actually, let me just finish this part. Uh, so I want to go ahead and, here I'm going to go ahead and put these two little pillars. One, two. One, two. And I'll just leave the crafting table here for now. Let me just finish fencing this whole thing up. And I will show you guys what I plan to do. Right, so I'm going to have to go ahead and get more of this uh, di uh, polished diorite to go ahead and uh, uh, put a block over this fence gate. This is basically like a little prison. You're not really you're not really supposed to see inside. So the plan is, is that you're not really meant to see inside what's inside this uh, place. But then again, you kind of want to see what's inside. So there's like this little opening here for that type of uh, feel such scheme. So actually for the next part of this uh, I actually need eggs so you guys probably know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna end up throwing all the eggs in there and see how many of them hatch so let me just make a quick run to the old village and my, oh, where my old uh, chicken farm is and I will go ahead and grab all the eggs there so I'll see you guys I will see you guys when I finish uh, finish my little trip here uh, this is the good old sweet home. Also reminds me, I actually, I actually need to go ahead and make a new fishing farm because because the one I actually made is here, actually right there. See, all right. So this is what I was talking about. This is the loud nature of this farm. All right, we got the eggs. I'm getting out of here just because of it's so loud and obnoxious. I'm just I'd rather go back to the basin. Keep doing what I was doing before it also gets loud and up nauseous over there. But that's a point in the little uh, uh, animal section of the of our property. So yeah, just, just jumping and jumping to this block world. So how many hours do you guys usually usually spend in my, on Minecraft? Because I can usually spend up to like three hours playing straight before I get I can get tired and then I want to do something else uh, yeah I can get pretty bored easily because I've been doing this game. it's been kind of re kind of repetitive but it's still fun mm -hmm. and enjoyable to me so all right now that we are up here we need to go ahead and perform the next phase of our plan and that is to go ahead and spam all these chicken eggs and out of that stack, I only got one. Alright, let's get the rest in. Boom! As there's a lot of rain, but we got all of them. And they're actually pretty loud now. Uh, next thing to go ahead and do is go ahead and put some hoppers down here and some chests to kind of finalize the project. Um, let's go do that right now before we end up getting lazy not doing it. So I got six hoppers and, and uh, eight chests. Uh, so this is what I want to do. Uh, right next to this hole right here, going lining up from this point right here, I want to go ahead and put two chests. We gotta make sure they're aligned. Yes, they are. Let's go ahead and put them. Stack them. There we go. And as planned. They should all fall in the future. There you go. They should all fall here. Uh, they they will be transferred transferred down. And oh, actually, they will get transferred to this chest. Once that chest is full, they will get transferred down here. Or yeah, actually, they, they should transfer down to the bottom chest first. 
Actually, let me get out of there. So they're gonna get transferred down to the bottom chest first, and then you know once that's full, they're gonna get transferred up to the to the top, top to the top chests. Damn, I cannot talk. <laughs> well, I can go ahead. I can successfully say that my building has now been finished with the chickens in there. They will go ahead and grow up and start laying me some eggs, which in turn I will collect so many more eggs to go ahead and reproduce all my chickens up there that I don't really have to worry about eggs ever again. So. That's just a win for me. And you guys may be wondering, where's my girlfriend? Where's my girlfriend? Uh, well, I don't know, because she's down there in the mine somewhere, huh? <laughs> Still mining, but I haven't found any freaking diamonds, so I'm trying to... Yeah, she has had no luck down there. She she hasn't found any diamonds, which reminds me, I kind of want to go ahead and create a, a mine, a uh, little mine shaft of my own, a little mining uh, area of my own, and... Uh, and just creating a huge mining hub from it, you know, but that'll be something for another episode uh, and a project when that should be done once things are kind of settled up here. But yeah, it's looking pretty nice. But thank you, thank you for anyone who has tuned in to go ahead and watch this. Uh, it's been a while. I'm so sorry about that. Uh, I will start uploading constantly that way I can keep up the keep up the rig the, the rhythm for this and uh, I do plan on going on some servers in the future so uh, kind of sticking to one server one survival server and then just touring a bunch of people's bases so that's gonna that's gonna be the series for the next for the next phase of, of this channel so thank you for anyone who has tuned in and I hope you have enjoyed or watched to this to this point so thank you very much goodbye Metal out.